Mitosis is an incredible process. It is one of the building blocks of life. Mitosis is a process in which cells replicate themselves. The cell divides to create two identical daughter cells. These daughter cells divide and divide and divide and divide and divide. There are six distinct phases of mitosis, the first being interphase. In interphase, the cell grows and replicates its DNA and centrioles. This DNA is the cell's genetic code, which has the directions for everything that the cell needs to make and do. The nuclear envelope houses the chromatin, which is a pool of disorganized DNA. The centrioles are organelles that assist in mitosis. Next, in prophase, a chromatin condenses into chromosomes, a more organized and compact form of DNA. The chromosomes, paired chromatids, are just two sets of identical DNA connected at the center by the centromere. The centrioles separate, moving to opposite sides of the cell. In between them, a spindle begins to form. The spindle is a fiber that comes from the centrioles. In prophase, the nuclear envelope also breaks down. Then, in metaphase, the chromosomes line up across the center of the cell. Each chromosome is connected to a spindle fiber at its centromere. After, in anaphase, the sister chromatids, which are the individual halves of the chromosome, separate into individual chromosomes. They are moved apart by the spindle fibers. Later, in telophase, the chromosomes gather at opposite sides of the cell and lose their distinct shapes. Two new nuclear envelopes will form around the newly separated chromosomes. The one cell is taking on a new shape. Finally, in cytokinesis, the last phase of mitosis, the cytoplasm, which is what makes up the body of the cell, pinches in half. Each daughter cell has an identical set of duplicate chromosomes. Two new cells have been born. They are identical to each other and will each go through mitosis again if needed.